a Zelda movie. They just announced in the weirdest, most casual, <laughs> un unexciting way <laughs> that they're making a Zelda movie. And I'm, I feel like such a nerd right now. I'm, sh I'm a little shaky. This is awesome. I don't, they, they're doing a live action Zelda movie. Miyamoto, Miyamoto's, it's, I'm getting my Mario movie. <laughs> I'm I I'm a huge Zelda guy. If you don't know that about me, uh, Mario was really good. The Mario movie was great. It was really cool. Wasn't for me. This is for me. I can't believe that Miyamoto is also making a Zelda movie. Uh, he's heavily attached to the project. Apparently, it's being made by Sony Pictures Entertainment, uh, with more than fifty percent financially backed by Nintendo and. And they've even talked about who's like producing and directing the entire thing. I have so many scatterbrained thoughts. I, 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 I guess we'll look at what's... I'm giddy, man. I'm so excited. It also is crazy because he tweeted, Miyamoto tweeted himself, This is Miyamoto. I've been working on the live action film of Legend of Zelda for many years now with Avi Ari's son. Avi Ari? Avi, Avi Ari... Ari I'm gonna give up. Uh, who has produced many mega hit films for several years? I mean, we've heard rumors of a Zelda movie for a while, but it's crazy that I guess this, this I mean, we didn't really know, no, for sure. So it was kept secret this whole time. Uh, I wanna look at kind of who's involved here and what we know so far. I mean, being produced by Sony is, I think, pretty great. We have a mix of Sony money and Nintendo money. It also makes sense that it's Sony because when you look at Avi, or Avi, I apologize if I'm pronouncing it wrong, and what he's worked on before, it's a lot of Spider-Man and Marvel, uh, specifically the Sony end of Spider-Man. Kind of a mixed bag here as far as like uh, good and good and bad movies. A lot of even video game movies in here, which makes sense, I suppose. Uh, producer is someone who kind of just throws money at a project that I think has some say, but they're not really like hands-on in creating the product. Um, I mean, I guess, I mean, I don't know. It's not like, we'll, we'll look at the director, but I, I care more about who's directing it than who's producing it. Although that being said, Miyamoto's a producer and I'm sure he's going to have a lot to say. So we have from the producer here, uh, both Spider-Man Into and Across the Spider-Verse, which were fantastic films. But then we also have Morbius, which, um, yeah, it's Lonkin time, I suppose. Also Uncharted, which, yeah, and the Venom movies, which, you know, they were fine. They were romps, but uh, I, I don't want that for Zelda. I really want this to get, I don't, I got, I got. I wish this was a situation where it was like when we heard about Mario with Universal because it was just so positive, right? Like there's almost no way it could be bad. Other than they announced Chris Pratt. And if they do that here, if Chris Pratt is playing Link, I'm out. I'm out. Please no. <laughs> Please no. But here we have much more of a mixed bag and Sony is known for kind of <laughs> destroying franchises sometimes. I mean, the X-Men, the new X-Men started really good and then ended how it ended. So we have a mixed bag in here of, of even the first Iron Man, which was sick. Uh, and it's being directed by Wes Ball, who I really don't know much about, but he directed the Maze Runner series. They've even, they've already updated the wiki with Legend of Zelda TBA. They, they're on it over here on wiki and Kingdom of Planet of the Apes. I'm not sure what any of these scored review wise, but I know the Maze Runner movies were pretty popular and did pretty well you look at like the stills of these movies and i still i do see a dystopian sort of grassy gritty feel to these movies so i could and, and also like action adventure and lighthearted and like um well not light i mean action adventure sort of with kids going on an adventure and that that spirit of uh, exciting uh, wonder, I guess, is what I'm kind of getting from the Maze Runner movies. And I can, I can see where that would bleed into Zelda, having this big world and action adventure, but also being gritty and kind of based in reality. So I can, I can see that. I can see why they, why they would be going for that. Ah, uh, yeah, but I don't, I don't really, 
I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> this is so out of nowhere just to get announced on Twitter like this. Uh, the first I saw of it was from Wario64, not even officially from Nintendo. So, also, he went on to say here, I have asked Avi-san to produce this film with me, and we have now officially started the development of the film with Nintendo itself, heavily involved in the production. It'll take time until its completion, but I look forward to seeing it. <laughs> Tom and Krista. <laughs> Krista from Kit and Krista. Tom Holland is Tingle. Yo. You know, we could... Ah, oh man. What? Wh who's even going to play? Is it all American actors? I'm guessing so, right? So, who's going to play Link? Who's going to play Zelda? Is Link going to talk? Is it going to be gritty and, and down to earth and real and a little dark? Or is it going to be lighthearted and adventurous and fun and Nintendo and springy? Personally, I'm terrified. Personally, I'm terrified. I don't know. I, I really, I don't. Oh, God. The, the last thing I want is to have a cringy, terrible Zelda movie that affects how I feel when I play Zelda again. Like when the new Zelda comes out. You, you know you're just going to see all the memes online from the movie the next time a Zelda is announced, you know? Uh, all of the excuse me princess moments from the Zelda 2024 movie or whenever it comes out. You look at the Mario movie and you're like, well, they did such a good job with that, but it was it was animated and it, it that fits so well with the Mario universe. I don't know what... Oh my God, my dog just scared the crap out of me. I don't know what... Uh, what Miyamoto's experience is like with live action. There's a language barrier there too. So like pr acting performances, I'm just, I'm really worried. I would love to know down below what your guesses, I guess, for who's gonna play these characters, who's gonna play Link. I'm just excited though. This is really cool. I'm glad I get my Zelda movie. I'm glad it looks like it's gonna have a big budget being backed by Nintendo and Sony. I just don't know. I just don't know. I can't look at this director and the 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 short amount of work that he's done and have confidence in that, you know? Also, Bob, this is not funny. This is not funny. Can we not with this, please? <laughs> that's not... That's not okay to make fun of me in my weakest hour. <laughs> what? Whoa, I didn't even... What story do you think they're gonna go with? Like, just a classic, original Link saving the princess story? Uh, like, starting as a as a kid in a village and getting a sword from a, uh, from a tree? From a talking tree? Though I guess he didn't get the master sword from the talking tree. But setting off on an adventure and the ocarina and, like, all of that? Or is it going to be, like, just another adventure in the tale of Link? Is it going to be a whole new... Zelda story of Link saving the princess, one that we haven't seen before. I, 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 I just, I just have so many questions. Okay, let me know all of your thoughts down below about actors and storylines, and if you're worried about the movie based on what we know, or if you think it's going to be great. Um, I'm gonna follow this closely. And um, I'm also live on Twitch right now if you want to come hang out. But that's beside the point. Okay, guys. I had to make a video about this because I am just... I'm... Sp I Whoa! <laughs>